Friday. This car was hit. Quarter panel and door. Yeah, right. Big dents. Uh, you know, on the door, the bondos, the deepest part of the bondo is about three eighths of an inch. I might be able to bang the door out, or if I get a skin, I could change the skin. And on this be easy to do the whole skin. Uh, this side, yeah, it was his. Just got two dings here. I haven't found any bondo in this door. Oh, yeah, there's a ding up big. There's a dent up here. It's not that deep, but there was a dent here too. I might be able to bang this out. I'm real good at that. I had one of the moldings and on the other quarter panel there was had a number of dents. It was all banked it banged up and creased. I have this hammer kit right here from AutoZone I bought it. It's got the little dollies and the the lead dollies and the lead hammers for doing sheet metal bodywork. Man, you can tell the thing was ever damaged anymore. I, I, I banged that shit with the hell out. And uh, this fender here, pinhole on right there. There's a hole there. That's where there was a rust spot. Everywhere there was a rust spot. I hit it with the wire wheel. It went right through. So I got one hole on top. Another one there. And then I got two more right here. So one, two, three, four, four holes in this fender. But no bondo. This fender was never hit. Oh, it's got a ding. I put this ding on here. I'll bang that out. I can get right right here. It's right here. I'll be able to bang that out. No bondo. You'll never know. Alright. But the quarter panel. I can't get in here and bang this shit out. Hell no. First of all, I gotta remove the freaking stereo system and all this electronics I put in here. Just to get behind it. There's no room to swing the hammer. So how are you gonna get it out? Even if you can get your hand in there. That's the side you gotta swing on. Alright? The dolly would go on this side. Alright? So... I don't know what to do with this. Yeah, it's a little low now because I ran the thing over it. I can feel it's low. I will fix this car and you will never know when I'm done. But the Chrysler 300, I did this a year ago or was it two years ago to the Chrysler? No, a year ago. It was about a year ago. I did the Chrysler. And it was the other quarter panel that was hit, and it was really hit bad. It was from one end to the other. And that quarter panel is like an S, you know? It has that shape to it, like an S, almost. And, uh, man, that was tough. Uh, I mean, it took me one whole month of my life to fix it. But it came so good. I mean, nobody can even tell. People don't even know that that car was ever hit, unless you tell them. You know? That was the only panel it was ever it was really hit. It had a ding in the hood. A ding in the hood, but the whole thing was really bad. Anyway, this car's coming along. Well, unfortunately, this job just got two weeks bigger because of this. This and that. And other, I mean, it just got two or three weeks more. Yeah, you know, I thought I would boom, boom, be be ready to paint it in a week, and then I would take a week to paint it. Oh man, I've been here almost two weeks now, and I still got like five body panels to go. 
then, you, then I got to do the door jams too. Got to do the door jams, the hood jams, the, the trunk jams. They all getting done. Everything's getting done. And as a matter of fact, underneath the car, there's hardly any paint on the bottom of the car at all. It was painted at one time, I could tell, because there is paint in some areas, but it's all peeled off. No rot, but surface rust everywhere. I need to finish the exterior of this car, and when I'm done, put it up on jack stands in here. And I'm going to put on a, a gas mask to protect my face and everything. And lay on my back and wire wheel all the bottom of this car. And then hit it with the uh, self-fetching primer and primer and paint. That's it. That's the Lincoln. We're getting there. We're getting there. I don't know. I got a couple hours in here. Just made a coffee. Let me drink my coffee before it gets cold. But anyway, that's the Lincoln tonight. Hot Rod Lincoln.